Hey there friends and welcome back to another video. We just got some pretty big multiverses news with multiple accidental character confirmations and more. If you do enjoy this video and you want to see more, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. Speaking of subscribing, only around 5% of the people watching this video are subscribed, even though 60% of you on this video are returning viewers. So subscribe because it makes it easier for you to see these videos and it makes number go up, which makes me happy. Also, there's a new member email available now inspired by a lot of comments. Also, this is for you. Where is my cheese? You're welcome. Hope you enjoyed that. Anyways, let's go ahead and get started. First off, we got some new skins confirmed from the Into the Verse live stream. Three of them are skins which I previously talked about in this leak video, which I'd highly recommend watching, by the way. We got the ex icon Agent Morty skin, Icon Director Sanchez skin, and the Solar Powered Man skin were all shown. Circuit Crew skins were shown for a few different characters, including Garnet. Has Wonder Woman, Banana Guard, Agent Smith, and Joker. Now, they did mention that these skins will tie into the Season 2 story. In my opinion, this will most likely be via Rift stuff, similar to the Megalodog Rift variant stuff, and it seems that the Circuit Crew is working for or with the trio I mentioned previously in like the uh, storyline. We also got another look at the WB backlot stage, including its opening door and the balloons that appear on the stage. And the balloons will like appear when someone is rung out onto the bottom or I think possibly the side. And the little door that pops open should have different characters inside, which is pretty interesting. There's also a lot of Easter eggs in the background of the stage, which I'll probably go over in the future. I don't want to take time to do that right now. The most interesting thing that was from this is that there was a possible character reveal. Now, in the background of the stream, we have a ton of memorabilia stuff, all being for different characters that are in the game. We've got Jason stuff, Superman stuff, Harley stuff, Bugs Bunny stuff, Agent Smith stuff, and more. But there's also a really odd one in the form of Pennywise from the It films. Now, it seems in the middle of the stream that this was removed after people noticed and mentioned it in the chat. And there's three possibilities of what this actually means. One, they did this as a tease for the future, maybe for season three, as that kind of goes around Halloween and it would make sense, though we don't have anything leaked for this character. Two, they did this on accident and removed it so that it wouldn't spoil stuff. Three, this was a mistake and they removed it because He's not coming and they don't want to get people's hopes up. It was just something that they had there. So let me know what your thoughts are on that, because that's really interesting. Now, in the official discord, they, they also accidentally confirmed a new character, which I've talked about in both of the recent leak videos, which for like the two people who thought I was lying and making that stuff up. What do you think now? Anyways, when they said thanks to everyone who worked on Agent Smith, they accidentally said thanks to everyone who worked on Samurai Jack. So yeah, Samurai Jack is now 100% confirmed. It was already pretty obvious he was coming in season two from Data Mines, but it's undeniable now. Plus, Ozil MV or Luisa on Twitter, which I've talked about a few times, actually posted a picture of Samurai Jack from the game. I don't know how they got this. I don't know if this was in the files or something, but it looks really good. I'm not going to sh I'm not showing this because, you know, copyright. But if you want to see it, you can go look at it. Although I think it actually just got taken down while I'm recording this. But another thing coming in season two seemingly is the ranked mode, which we now have more info on thanks to Shaggy leaks on Twitter. The current ranked mode event start date in the files is Thursday, August 1st, lasting until Tuesday, October 1st, with the latter date presumably being rank reset. Ranked mode will be playable in three sets, and there will be ranked rewards. There are eight ranks total, and there will be a ranked level lock. There's also a new ranked system of stars. Bronze and silver ranks will follow a new progression system this time around, which is stars. Ten stars are needed for each division in bronze and silver, and there are three divisions total. You get one star for winning and more stars for things like ring outs, sportsmanship, not getting rung out, and double ring outs. You can also lose stars for things like disconnects, self-destructs, and losing. Gold stars are obtained after every five wins. Your overall star count cannot drop below a gold star. 
This system may change leading up to release as when looking, they found a lot of contradicting data as to how many wins were needed, one or five. Now, there's also another new ranked system being RP. RP or ranked point progression replaces stars at gold rank and above. RP is gained through wins and lost through losses. Master and Grandmaster players lose 60 RP per day after seven days without playing a ranked match without playing a ranked match with their fighter down to 2500 RP. Now we also got confirmation that another Into the Verse live stream will happen next Monday at 9 a.m. Pacific time and will be about season two, which should release Monday night slash Tuesday the next day. Anyways, anyways, that's going to be it for the video. If you did enjoy, you know, leave a like, subscribe, etc. We're going to be doing more conversations about this in the future. Also, if you want to see what stuff is seeming like it's going to be in it, maybe check out the past two leak videos because we have a lot of info on what seems to be coming. Also, if you want to make sure you get Agent Smith before it's too late to get him for free, uh, click on this video that's on the screen right now. Huge thanks to the channel members. Zach P, Fighter Kid, Storm God 5746, Paco Catfish, and David Lawless.